Hello, I welcome you all to this another interesting uh, screencast and the problem reads uh, determine the force P needed to hold the 60 pounds weight in equilibrium. Uh, this problem is coming from uh, the Engineering Mechanics uh, Statics, uh, Statics uh, textbook, 13th edition by R.C. Hibela. So, uh, one assumption here that we have we are saying there is no friction uh, between uh, the cable and the pulley. Okay, so if that is the case, then you expect the same tension on one side to be equal to the other side. All right, so we have three pulleys here. We have three pulleys. Let's call this as our pulley A, and we call this one our pulley B, and we call this one our pulley C. Right, and then uh, when we look at this connection here, when you look at this connection here, okay, these cables or these cables, they are connected at the pin, all right? This pin, okay, where the pulley is connected, right? So that when you pull the cable where we have a P here, okay, the pulley, as you pull this cable, pulley A is pulled up, and as you lower this cable uh, at P, pulley A is lowered down, right? All right. So let's draw these pulleys. Uh, we start with, I think, let me, re okay, it's fine. Let's draw pulley B. Okay. Pulley B. Uh, we have this pulley here. This is too small. Okay, like so. And then let's say that is the support there. This is where it is supported. So we have this cable that goes over like this. And then we have the force P applied, and we have this cable going over there. So this value of T will be equal to, this value here is also going to be equal to P, right? Of course, okay, because there is no friction. Okay, then let's draw fully uh pulley pulley b i mean pulley a pulley a so we have this pulley here we have this pulley here so this pulley um we have this cable here this cable there that is coming from pulley B, this is pulley B. Okay, we have this cable there that is going around like so. So this cable here is the T, okay. And then it goes over, uh, it goes over like so, it goes over up like so so let's call that also as our t as our t this is another t okay so imagine we have done a section here this is where we have done a section so we have these tension forces here this is what we are talking about right now Okay, so this is a T, this is T, this is T, and also those up there. 
All right, and then we have another cable that is connected at the point where the pin is. Okay, since this is a continuous cable, it will have the same value T, T, T. And then later on, we have a cable there connected at the same pin where we have a weight of 60 pounds. All right, so if we are to, this is pulley, pulley A. So if we are to apply the equations of uh, just one equation of equilibrium summation of forces in the y equal to zero, going up in our reference, here we are going to have, um, mind you, we already found what P is, uh, I mean what T is. So here we are going to have 3T uh, minus 60 equal to zero. Then we know already that T, T is equal to, uh, T is equal to P, okay? And hence, our T here is going to be equal to 60 divided by 3 is 20, okay? And therefore, and therefore, since T is equal to P, so this is going to be equal to 20 pounds. So this is equal to 20. This is equal to 20. And this is equal to 20. All right. We can also just draw policy, not that uh, just for sh to show what is happening. But we've already found the answer. So we have policy. Policy, let's say is connected also to the support somewhere up there. All right. Of course, we know we said this cable here, it is this one here, this one here, it is this one here, okay. And then here we have, uh, we have this cable there, which is a T also, and uh, this cable here, which is also a T. Okay, and this cable here, it is this one here. Let me just show it. It is this one here. Okay. So uh, this is really about it. We found what T is, which is equal to P and is equal to 20 pounds. I hope the video was helpful. And if it was, let me just replace also what these values are. So here we say this is equal to 20. This is equal to 20. This is equal to 20 and this is equal to 20. All right. So if the video is helpful, give me a thumbs up, like my video, continue subscribing and liking my channel. Bye-bye and I'll see you in my next uh, screencast.